Hello everybody again, it's YG Unboxer coming at you guys with another pack break opening. This time we have Dark Ascension. This pack brought us cards like Soren, Lord of Innistrad, Haven Gull Lich, uh, Falcon Wrath of Ristro Cat, um, many other cool cards. You got Tybalt the Fiend Blooded, which apparently him and Soren are having a dual deck made after him. That's not going to be the best. But anyways... Let's pop into these packs. So they're all different this time, so I gotta cut them all. Our first one is Haven Gull Lich. I've actually had really good luck with these uh, Dark Ascension packs, so hopefully we get lots of foils and pull some. Uh, oops, gotta remember what my file is. And uh, maybe some decent just rares and stuff. And stop that! Do we have a foil? No, okay. So yeah, there's a Torch Fiend, as you saw in the last video, that's actually, um, in my, uh, 2013. This is actually an uncommon, which is, I thought, the worst idea ever. Grave Purge. Nephalia Sea Kite. Wild Hunger. Ray of Revelation. Highborn Ghoul, great for zombies. Saving Grasp. Evolving Wild, standard, uh... Uh, fetch land. Uh, Talons of Falconrath. That's uh, pretty freaky. She's a scary vampire. Relentless Scab. So five for as an additional cost to cast uh, exile creature and has undying. So it comes back as a five five. So for five and sacrificing a creature. You, ha you get a 5-5. Five five. That's not very good. Gavany Iron Red. So 3 for Fateful Hour as long as you have 5 or less life. Other creatures you control ha get plus 1, plus 4. And he's, so he turn eh, he gets just his stats. It's funny. Secrets of the Dead. So th for 3, whenever you cast a spell from a graveyard, draw a card. That's good for... um. Uh, what's that ghoul? Uh... Oh my god, oh, I can't remember his name right now. And our rare is Thalia, Guardian of Thrab, and this card is actually really good. So we have a 2 for a 2-1, Legendary Human Soldier. First strike, non-creature spells cost 1 more to cast, so this is like anti, uh, anti-creatures. So that's great for a white weenie deck. So moving on to... So werewolf guy that I can't remember. It's a rare card. I think it's a rare card. It might be an uncommon. I can't remember. But whatever the werewolf student name is. So opening it. Ooh. Okay, so we have Break of Day. Uh ooh. Oopsie. Uh gruesome discovery. Screeching Scab, Near Hearth Stalker, Crushing Vines, Dawn Treader Elk, Reap the Sea Graf, Scorch the Fields, Divination, different artwork. So then we got a Curse of Thirst. So for 5, it's Enchant Player. At the beginning of Enchanted Player's upkeep, Curse of Thirst deals damage to that player equal to the number of curses attached to him or her. So instantly it does 1. Usually they can get rid of these, so not the best. We got Tracker's Instincts for 2. Reveal the top 4 cards of your library. Put a creature card from among them into your hand and shuffle the rest into your deck with Flashback. Eh, yeah, not the best card. Secrets of the Dead, and our rare is... Jeroff's Mind Crusher. So for a 6, it's a when Jeroff's Mind Crusher enters the battlefield, target player puts the top 5 cards of his or her library into his or her graveyard, and has not died. So it's a 6 for a 5-5, five five, or potentially a 6-6, six six, so that's not the best card in the world. And oh, hey, nice. We do have a... Uh, Another rare, we got Ravenous Demon, so it's 5 for a Sacrifice a Human, Transform Ravenous Demon. Uh, then we got Archdemon of Greed, 
flying and trample. At the beginning of your upkeep, sacrifice a human. If you do, if you can't, tap Archdemon of Greed and it deals 9 damage to you. So this is great for a white weenie deck with a splash of black. I really love this card. <clears throat> so, hang on here. I kind of had a little mix up. Okay, I'm actually missing something. Oh, okay, there it is. Never mind. Okay, on to our third and final pack. Soren. Soren, bring us luck. Bring us luck of Innistrad. Mr. Lord. Wow, no foils of these. So we got ourselves Skillful Lunge. Haunted Fengraf, Favor of the Wilds, another Torch Fiend, Artful Dodge, Grit Card, Sightless Ghoul, Alvenwald Bear, Elgwad Inquisitor, Niblis of the Mist, then we got a Wolf Hunter's Quiver, so one. Enchanted creature has tap. This creature deals one damage to target creature or player, and tap. This creature deals three damage to target werewolf creature. Equip. Five. Tower Geist for four. Flying whenever, uh, when Tower Geist enters the battlefield, look at the top two cards of your library, put one of them into your hand, and the other into your graveyard. So it's just to help you draw. And then Village Survivors for five. Vigilance. Fade for life as long as you have five or less life. Other creatures you control have Vigilance. And our rare is a Mythic Rare, actually. Uh, Begwiller of Will, so a human wizard for 5, it's a 1-1. One, one. Gain control of target creature with power less than or equal to the number of creatures you control. Wow, out of all the mythics, we have to pull that one. Honestly, could have been a better pack opening, but whatever. This pack is now done off of our list of packs. See you guys all next time.